lessons from the life of new testament joseph he seems to be a man of no words but a man of good deeds right actions and that's amazing i am a man of many words and god has given me the gift of words i'm i'm glad i've given this opportunity to use the gift of words that he has given me to bless and edify and encourage people but uh, joseph seems to have spoken nothing he kept it all within himself not only that <clears throat> he kept his mind even his thinking process accessible for the holy spirit to intervene interject and give his thoughts to him to joseph joseph as was a man of no words or few words but was a man of great deeds men women children young old whoever whoever you may be god has called you to be a person of good deeds because you know what after your death if jesus would still tarry your works would continue you can leave behind a great monument of achievements that you have done for humanity for eternity be a person of good deeds god has saved us god has called us god has washed us god has anointed us for good works good deeds so be it come as you